When it first opened in 1917, the Grand Central Market was the largest public market on the West Coast. It is the oldest continually running market in Los Angeles for over a hundred years. The market was then, and still is, a mosaic of different ethnic communities that had built Los Angeles into the megacity that it is today. Located in the heart of downtown Los Angeles is a historic building. The Grand Central Market is a bustling food market with diverse range of cuisines, restaurants, and fresh produce. It is Los Angeles in a microcosm. The market is often packed with people of all ages, drawn by the delicious food and unique experience. It is a place that people come to see, explore, and eat. It is a unique food emporium and eating experience. It is a bit overwhelming with all the sights, sounds, and smells that greet you. Various stalls and vendors line the market's crowded aisles, with stalls selling everything from Mexican tacos to Korean barbecue to Italian pasta. It can be hard to decide where to start as you watch chefs expertly chop, toss, and cook their specialty dishes. The market today is home to 40 different vendors and part of the city's bustling food scene. It is a showcase for the city's best entrepreneurs, chefs, and is filled with products, ingredients, and food that is some of the best the city has to offer. There is an impressive amount of gourmet dry goods. There are artisan cheeses and meats, freshly baked pastries and sweets. It's hard to resist warm flaky croissants or good chocolate brownies or food stalls that offer fresh squeezed juices and smoothies. This celebrated downtown landmark has longtime vendors such as the China Cafe, which opened in 1960, while Roast to Go has been operating since 1952. You can try Filipino food, a Korean pork belly with kimchi and rice. Salvadorian parpusas are made fresh on the spot. Originally started as a food truck, Egg Slut is one of the most popular food stops at the market, with gourmet food in a stall that was established in 2013. The small menu is inspired by the key ingredient of chicken eggs. Its signature dish is the slut, which is a jar of soft eggs over creamy mashed potatoes and chives and three slices of toast. Simply very tasty. After enjoying the Grand Central Market's cuisine, opposite the market, just across Broadway, is the Bradbury Building. If you've never seen inside the beautiful Bradbury Building in person, take a few minutes to cross Broadway and check it out. The Bradbury Building is an architectural landmark, the oldest commercial building in downtown Los Angeles and a unique treasure. Its unassuming Italian Renaissance style exterior hides a wonderful light filled Victoria era interior with open bird cage elevators, marble staircases, and ornate railings. Built in 1893, it is known for its extraordinary five story atrium, walkways, and ornamental cast iron works. Enter the center court and you are suddenly taken back 120 years. The Bradbury has appeared in many motion pictures, television shows, and music videos, most famously as a location for the epic Blade Runner. Visitors may access the lobby and use the stairs, with the elevators used by tenants only. A gorgeous building, it is open daily and well worth the visit. On the west side of the Grand Central Market, off Hill Street, is another downtown landmark, the Angels Flight Railway. Angels Flight functions as a railway service to residents that live in the area with access to the Grand Central Market. It takes passengers on a short ride between Hill Street and the market and the California Plaza 
at the top of Bunker Hill and Grand Avenue. Originally opened in 1901, Angel's Flight is the world's shortest railway. It has two cars that run in opposite direction on the 298-foot inclined railway. The railway has appeared in numerous movies and television series, making its debut in 1918's The Good Night Nurse. More recently, it appeared with Ryan Gosling and Emma Stone in the movie La La Land. The railway is a big tourist attraction. It has provided more than 100 million rides on its hillside track. The fare is a dollar each way. You can purchase a round-trip souvenir ticket for $2 for the one-of-a-kind experience. Downtown Los Angeles has undergone a renaissance in recent years. Nowhere reflects that change more than this part of downtown. The Grand Central Market is one of the leading attractions in Los Angeles that everyone should visit at least once. It is home to some of the country's most iconic eateries as well as a great selection of cuisines from around the world. It is one of the best food experiences and a destination temptation that shouldn't be missed.